oftentimes when a you know guy goes down and a new corner comes in, they'll go at you. They did yeah. test you down the field a couple of times. Did you feel that? And how did you respond to it? Uh, you know, I think uh, from an offense standpoint, they want to test everyone, and especially if someone gets hurt and gets down and um, a new guy coming in. Um, they want to test you, and I don't think they did as much as they, they should have. I mean, either way, I would have been prepared, and it's always next guy up in this in this business. So uh, I think I had a, a good supporting cast around me, thank, thankfully, and uh, we just got the win and got out of there. What was the mindset in general going into that last drive for the defense? Um, just don't do anything stupid. Maintain your leverage on everything, and um, you know, just keep keep things in front of you. And then, I mean, they're not going to get a 70-yard play sure. on, on one play, so just be smart about it. How surprising was it for you guys that, that Duggan kind of ended up being more of a runner than you probably anticipated coming into this one? Yeah, so I mean, we obviously know Delton, he's a runner, and uh, so we've kind of been preparing all week for him being the runner, and then um, I get, think maybe we let our guard down a little bit with Duggan, but we, he was he was a really good athlete, and he was a really good thrower too, so um, respect to him, and uh, yeah, credit, give credit where credit is. And he had had some games where he went off for some pretty big passing yard numbers. What were you guys going to do to kind of contain him there? Well, we had a lot of good calls, thankfully. Scotty has one of the best in the nation, I think. And, um, you know, coming back from two losses in a row, we had a different mindset and a different uh, standpoint on things to get things right and get the details right. You mentioned those losses. How big was it to get this first win in more than a month for you guys? Yeah, well, we needed it. Um, I think Baylor was winnable and Oklahoma State was winnable too. A lot of people, you know, on Twitter and newspapers and all that, they don't think so. But um, I do think that we came out and we had a mindset just fourth quarter battle, um, all, all game, not giving up. And so um, it was really important to get a win, especially the first Big 12 play. Do you feel like it changes anything moving forward just in terms of the, the guy's mindset? You know, you got that one off your back rather than going to face Oklahoma at 0-3. Yeah, so um, you know, it'll give us some momentum. A, a little, a little momentum is better than none. So, um, getting it off our back and kind of getting the pressure away from us, um, I think it'll be a good thing going into the game. What are the lessons that you guys maybe learned in, in facing Duggan and his ability to be able to run the ball today that you can take into the next game when you guys face Jalen Hurts? Yeah, so I think um, for every quarterback, we need to respect the running game and the passing game. Um, Jalen Hurts obviously is a great, a great player, a great runner, and even a better thrower. I think so. Um, they haven't missed a beat with their quarterback going and leaving with Baker, Kyler, and, and Jalen. But um, I think it's going to be a necessity to keep them contained and do our job. 